And now to a very, very new feature in IEEE Explorer. If you are affiliated uh, or you're a student or researcher with an institution who has an IEL, an institutional subscription to IEEE Explore Digital Library, you can change the listing of the results from documents to images. These images are um, basically are, you're searching not just within the documents, but if you go to the image search, you are searching within nearly 3 million images uh, from all the IEEE publications. So images, graphs, charts, uh, flowcharts uh, from the IEEE journals. And these images are retrieved and ranked based on keywords matches of the image metadata. So you are searching in this search within the images metadata. And if you hover over uh, the images, uh, you can uh, see them in bigger resolution. You can see also the, the, uh, the article where they are published in. And if you click on show in context, you're opening the full text article and you can instantly go to this figure or picture in the article. Why would you do this feature? For many of you, um, you can combine this when you're looking for relevant literature. For many of you, it's, it's, uh, you would immediately recognize an image uh, or graphs, um, visualizations. Uh, so you can combine these two types of searching, searching within the, the articles and represented by the list of um, article titles listed, or you can change it to the image search. So test it if you have, your institution has an institutional subscription to IEEE Explore Digital Library, you will see this feature enabled. Uh, next step could be to refine and resort, well, refine your search. I would maybe recommend to look for um, the journal uh, articles, uh, Professor Giona was uh, explaining what are the main differences between these two content types. So you can also, also use this as a source to find those journals or those magazines where you could potentially submit your submission because this is where these articles, these journal titles are probably the most relevant communication channels for your, in your field uh, to reach out to your colleagues. Uh, and I filtered this for the last five years. You see here also an example from our uh, very successful um, fully open access journal, a multidisciplinary journal, I to access, uh, where the authors can publish graphical abstracts even. So this is the first uh, example. That's also a great way if you would like to promote your paper later.